What's going on guys? Chad here at Marine Max Jupiter. Today, we're on Boston Whalers 280 Outrage. Let's get right into it. This boat's equipped with the new V8 300 horsepower Mercury four strokes. Just in front of those, we're gonna have three rod holders on the transom here, as well as your freshwater fill and your waste pump out. Very conveniently located on the starboard side here. You have a freshwater sprayer just before you get into the cockpit of the boat. It's very nice if maybe you're bringing the kids to the sandbar, everyone can spray off the sand outside of the boat. Now, another thing I really want to point out with these Boston Whalers is their quality. They have yacht quality hardware. Look at the oversized hinges here on your port side uh, swim door. You can easily open it and have it stowed. There, it's a nice holder for that. You have your ladder access here. Maybe you're going swimming or diving. You want to be able to get onto the boat that way. Now, maybe you're fit doing some fishing here. You want some more room on the back deck. You can easily stow this back bench seat here. Underneath here, you have your bilge access on both port and starboard. You have your insulated fish boxes on the starboard side here underneath the gunnels. You have fishing pole holders, or you could also use this for maybe a deck brush as well. Uh, at the leaning post here, this is the deluxe leaning post. You're gonna get your sink, uh, your fish well right here, as well as two cup holders, two rod holders, and you even get your slide out Yeti cooler. Really neat feature. Now, you have five, uh, rocket launchers here off the hard top working our way up to the helm the seats are bolstered this nice gray color very soft to the touch at the helm here you're gonna have twin simrad electronics as well as your mercury vessel view simrad vhf more storage two cup holders and your trim tab which i really like where those are located right here nice easy access and at the front of the glass here, you actually even have a vent too, it's automatic. Above, right above your head, you have more storage. Definitely not a lack of storage on these boats. Now we're gonna go over to the starboard side here, which is how you get down into the bathroom area or storage. Now I'm about six foot myself and I can almost stand up in here. As you can see, there's plenty of room Another cool little feature here is if you're storing fishing pole holders up in the front, you have access here where if the fishing poles are too long, they can actually stick into this cabin as well. Now, another thing I'd really like to point out is this boat's equipped with JL audio speakers throughout the boat. There definitely is not a lack of speakers on this boat. You have two in the front, you're gonna have two on port and starboard here at the helm, as well as two more in, in the transom of the boat. Now working our way up to the front, you see this boat also has a windshield wiper here on the glass for those uh, maybe stormy or rainy days. You have a very nice uh, seat here off the front of the console. You have a cup holder on either side, armrests that can go up or down. And then inside of this, Wait till you see this. The amount of storage that's here is incredible. And you have two dedicated spots for five gallon buckets, as well as steps to get in and out. And close that up. Uh, off the front of the boat, you have your windlass up in the front here. That's the hatch up in the center. More cup holders on port and starboard up in the front. Storage underneath this front center cushion. We have two cleats up here on the front as well. Nice light, spreader light off the front of the hard top. And that's gonna conclude our walkthrough today on the Boston Whaler 280 Outrage.